morning, Lynn Classical family, and welcome to another episode of The Ram Report. Classical's home for all school <laughs> news and information. <laughs> Today is Wednesday, November 29th, 2023. I'm Trevin. And I'm Steven. Let us begin with today's trivia question. How many cities and towns are in Massachusetts in total? Stick around to find out. If you are looking to work and are under 18 years old, you'll need a work permit before to be hired. Work permits are available in the main office before and after school. Do not come to the main office for work permits during the school day. Need a laptop? Loan devices are available in the library. Sign out a loan computer is easy. Just see Mrs. Tolly in the library. Loan laptops must be returned at the end of the day. If you want to park in the school's parking lot, you need to get a student parking permit. Student parking permits are given out before school from 7.30 a.m. to 7.45 a.m. and after school from 2.30 p.m. to 3 p.m. License and registration is required. Want to do what we do in the studio? Consider joining the TV club ran by Mr. Donahue. The TV club is ran right in the studio, in the classical studio, in room B2, B107. Classical clubs are open and available to all. Check out Latin Club, run by Mr. Ayers in C203 on Tuesdays. Asian American Club meets in the library on Thursdays after school. Don't forget about Gaming Slash Computer Club with Mr. Orell on Tuesdays in both A301 and B311. The Mental Health Club is ongoing. The Mental Health Club is, to quote their flyer, a club for raising mental health awareness in our schools. The mental Health Club meets on Thursdays in the library at 2.30 p.m. Talk to Miss Amber in social work for more. The Spanish Club, better known as the United Latin Association, is accepting members. Meetings are held on Fridays in C204. See Mrs. Sargardia for more information on how to join. The African and Arab Club is in its first year and has just started. The club is trying to unite African and Arab students in Lynn Classical and at Lynn in general. Meetings will happen in room C201. Message Miss Camis for more. The Social Justice Club is also back in season. The Social Justice Club is a group of students with two main goals in mind to learn and educate ourselves about the many different social justice issues in the world. And Social Justice Club meets on Tuesdays in B2, B302 with Mr. Guerin. Interact Club is now underway. The club meets in room C106 on Thursdays from 2.30 to 3.15. Message Ms. Jenkins for more. Art Club meets in room D102 from 2.30 to 3.30. See Mrs. Sutton for more. Chess meets in room B211 on Thursdays and Fridays. See Mr. Winchester for more information. Come join the Environmental Club on Mondays from 2.30 to 3.30 p.m. Are you interested in recycling, saving endangered species, and cleaning up our beaches, parks, and the city of Lynn? Join the Environmental Club today. Looking for a club with a safe, inclusive space to meet new friends, have fun, and build communities? Join the Gender and Sexuality Alliance Club. Meetings are held in room B203 on Thursdays from 2.45 p.m. to 3.45 p.m. The Lynn Classical Theater, Com Theater Company will be presenting a new production of the classic Alice in Wonderland. The dates for the play are December 5th, 6th, and 8th. See Mr. Al Shai for more information. Any junior or senior who is interested in representing Lynn Classical at the 2024 State Student Government Day in Boston, please see Mr. Spil Spilakios in room A306. Now we welcome you to join us for the Pledge of Allegiance. All right, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, there you go. The trivia question, how many cities and towns are in the state of Massachusetts in total is 
351. Well, that's it for today's episode of the Ram Report. Stay updated with us to hear the latest school news and information. Until then, don't forget to live every day like Rams. We value rigor, accountability, making connections, and success. And don't forget to like and subscribe. From all of us here at in the TV studio at LCTV, I'm Trevin. And I'm Steven. All, all the, the best. best. Since 1986, Lynn Educational Television has enabled students to work in the television industry and learn how to produce media. LETV creates working opportunities for Lynn students, giving them the benefit of gaining real-life work experience in production. Lynn Educational Television brings value to Lynn students, delivering standards-based curriculum in the classroom from middle school to high school. LETV creates future generations of media professionals.